politics, entertainment stories, current affairs, and exclusive interviews. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome on The Buzz UG with, with Melanz Mino, Mino, a.k.a. Fuller. This one, we don't need to, to say, sir. Hmm? President Museveni should also be responsible for, 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 for his sins, for, uh, for appointing rotten people into these ministries. They should simply resign, go to Ruzira. I think the DPP can uh, go to court and obtain a warrant of detain. They, then they will be processed like other criminals. Now, a month after the Parliament of Uganda sessioned Pasi Sinamuganza, the Minister for Lands, Housing and Urban Development, the members of Parliament from Karamoja sub-region have also notified the Speaker of Parliament, the Right Horrible Anita Among, the intention to present a session motion against the Minister of Karamoja Affairs, Dr. Mary Goretti Chitutu. The members of Parliament accused the Minister of Mismanagement of Office, violation of the oath of allegiance and will for indiscipline. We have demanded for a resignation and she has not taken it to that. And this was actually the most important thing for her to do. And so we have given the Parliament of Uganda a notice for a censure motion so that the Minister will be forced to leave our office, the office she has abused. She will explain in the house how she gave her friends the iron sheets meant for Karamoja. We are witnessing a, in a nation is people that have lost morals, lost conscience. She abused our office. She diverted the resources that were meant for the vulnerable people in Karamoja. They revealed that the motion will be ready in two days, adding that they will process this session to its conclusion for the people of Karamoja to be served with justice. Some members of parliament have expressed readiness to sign the session motion, urging that the minister should also be prosecuted as soon as the investigations are concluded. Uh, this is embezzlement, it is corruption, and I think uh, after investigations, the minister should be prosecuted. Censor is a very serious matter that people should not rush to. An investigation is going on. Let us get facts. I would support any effort towards punishing them so that the other ministers can appreciate why they are in those offices. Now, the Karamoja docket falls under the office of the Prime Minister and according to a big section of members of Parliament, it's regrettable that the Right Horrible Robina Nambanja should distance herself in the Karamoja iron sheet scandal and yet the accused minister is under her direct supervision. I, I salute her courage that uh, she, she can even be able to come on a TV station to explain this. You cannot explain this. She supervises the minister. That's where the problem is. She supervises the minister. I, I, I don't know where she's going to put that. Now, the bitter legislators say the investigations into the scandal should not be handled by the office of the prime minister, but independent organs. In her discussion, she demonstrated goodwill to investigate and follow up the matter. Now, my issue, my issue is this matter cannot be investigated by prime minister's office. No. The president should find how to deal with his ministers. This minister was in environment. Her performance regarding the restoration, in, in, the wetlands were destroyed in her eyes. Hmm? In her eyes. This minister was in charge of energy, a big minister, was in charge of energy. She led to the collapse of Raya. Hmm? Rural Electrification Agency. She led to each collapse. Now she's in Karamoja. She's going to lead to the collapse of Karamoja. Eh? But I challenge our colleagues from Karamoja to take on the mantle and see Honorable Chitutu account. Now, the members of parliament urge that the Karamoja minister, Mary Goretti Chitutu, could have misled her superiors, but even then, it's not reason enough to consider them innocent. I've been seeing a list of people circulating, vice president, prime minister, uh, even the speaker. I mean, that is only scapegoating because the officers in the office of prime minister and specifically in the Karamoja ministry know where the iron sheets were supposed to be allocated. These ministries were put there for them to collect the relief, go and use for their own politics. 
That's what they have been doing. Whether it is Ruero Triangle, whether it is Minister of Disaster, I didn't know that Karamoja has also joined. Well, there you go. That is the latest update on the Buzz UG. And in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications right here on the Buzz UG. My name is Melads Milo, aka Fula, and it's a bye for now. Audio jump.